Hello and welcome to today's SAP Business One video on the Pick and Pack Production Manager within the Inventory Module. Today I'm going to give you an overview of how the functionality of the Pick and Pack Manager is used within SAP Business One. It's a great tool and our customers use it a lot. To start this process, I'm going to open up my menus here on the left. I'm going to scroll into Inventory. Then I'm going to move down to Pick and Pack and I'm going to choose my Pick and Pack Production Manager. This automatically populates a selection criteria based on what documents I want to see and the warehouses that are located in for the information. Once I click OK, it takes that information and populates all open orders based off the selection criteria within the system. From here, I can choose what order I want to, want to use to create a pick list. I'm going to use document 402 in order to generate a pick list. Next, I'm going to release the pick list, and this sends it to the release drawer. But first, we must use the pick list generation wizard. To start the wizard, you click Next. Here, you can select pick list by the following options. However, I'm just going to move forward within the process. And here's the pick list that is generated. Here's our pick list number based off of the user that's using it and the picker, and all the total documents and quantities and I'm ready to generate. Once I'm ready to generate, I click generate and this generates a pick list. I move to my release drawer and I find the document that I just created. It was pick list 55 and now we're ready to pick the items that we release based off of the order. I drill into the pick number list and here's the pick list that was generated. You can do a partial or full quantity pick but I'm ready to do a full quantity, so I can just click Pick All and click Update. Then I click OK. This takes me back to my screen here, and now I'm ready to move to the Pick, excuse me, to the Pick drawer. I click on the Pick drawer, and we can see here that here's the item that we created based off of the pick list. Here, I can select my item. And from here, I have the ability to create a manual delivery, an automatic delivery, an invoice, an inventory transfer, an issue for project, excuse me, an issue for production, and a receipt from production. As you can see, the Pick and Pack Manager is a great tool and very user friendly. This concludes the Pick and Pack Production Manager video, and I thank you for listening.